everyone, you're watching Newegg TV. I'm Jennifer, and today I'm here with Trisha Welsh, who is representing a product called the Neo, or Neo Tag, and it is designed to help you remember your important electronic devices. So hi, Trish, how are you doing? I'm great, thanks, how are you? Good, I'm really glad you came in today. They sent me an email about this product a few weeks back, and I was really curious about it because I hadn't seen anything like it before. So can you tell me just really quickly, what is the Neo Tag? So the Neo is a device that just helps you to avoid that moment where you panic and go, where's my phone or where's mm -hmm. my iPad or where's my device? Mm -hmm. So what Neo is, is it creates a buddy system between your smartphone and your valuable. And if either of them are separated, they both alarm. So Neo is to try and alleviate some stress and worry. We're all busy. We're all going 7,000 miles an hour. And what it does is gives you that little bit of a reminder saying, mm -hmm. hey, don't forget me. Pick me up before you leave the restaurant, the cab, the washroom, anywhere where people tend to leave their phones behind. Okay, so a um, best use scenario would be you walk out of a restaurant mm -hmm. without your device. You leave it on the table like so many of us, you know, we have our little thing on the table with us. Yeah. What would happen? So what happens is, this is your Neo tag here. So what okay. you do is you create a Bluetooth chain using Bluetooth 4.0, and it creates a chain system that when it's broken, they both alarm. So the nice thing about Neo is you get to pick the distance that it will alarm. So here you can see, I can have it really close to me if I want to keep a really tight leash mm -hmm. on my iPad, or I can have it further away if I'm at home, I don't want this going off every time right. I walk around a room. So the nice thing is here, I can show you, if I want to keep it really close to me, I put it to really close, and let's pretend I'm in a restaurant mm -hmm. and I have my keys, and this is attached to my keys, my purse, my knapsack, any other device, and I walk out leaving my iPad or my phone on, okay. the, on the table. As I walk away, you can see now they're both alarming. Oh, wow. So this is alarming, saying go okay. back and pick it up. So the nice thing is, I have my app lock set on. So when the app lock goes on, as you saw, it keeps alarming. So what happens is you can't shut off the alarm until you put the code in. So if people don't know your code, the only way they can shut off the alarm is by turning off the phone. And then once they do that, it initiates your own security levels there. In my mind, I'm just imagining like a, you know, somebody with a device that they've stolen running down the street, like, and it's just going off. So it's like a car alarm, you know, if you're yes. trying to drive in a car alarm, everyone's staring at you. Sorry, no, I, I can't answer it. <laughs> 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 yeah, so the, and, and that's it, because mm -hmm. every year in the U.S. alone, um, every 30 seconds, hundreds of smartphones oh, that's are... That's right. I, that's what in, really intrigued me about the Neo when I first started researching it is the statistic you told me. Mm -hmm. And what was it? That every 30 seconds, 100 smartphones are lost or stolen. So... Um, that's just like in the first, you know, and when I did the intro for this video, that means 100 smartphones or um, devices were stolen just in me saying hi. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, and, and most thefts of smartphones and devices mm -hmm. is because somebody is forgetful. Most people aren't stealing these. I mean, there is apple picking, but mm -hmm. most times it's because you've left it behind. You've left right. it at a restaurant, you've left it in a washroom, you've left it in a cab, and it, somebody finds it and then keeps it. Right, it's a... Crime of opportunity. Crime of opportunity. So if we can avoid that by saying, hey, here's a little device that says, hey, pay attention. You mm -hmm. left me behind. Pick me up before I go missing. The other cool thing is this is a two-way communication. Okay. So if I walk out with my iPad or my phone and I'm doing this uh -huh. and I have this attached to my laptop bag, as soon as I walk away from it, it's going to remind me and say, hey, go back and pick up your bag before it goes missing. Right. So it's a two-way alarm system to prevent the loss or theft of your smartphone, your iPad, or any other device. I imagine it could work with like your keys too, you know, keeping you from losing your keys or getting too far away from your keys while we're all, you know, lost in our little Twitter worlds. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, definitely <laughs> for that. The other really cool thing is, let's say you are at a coffee shop and how mm -hmm. many times do we put our bags on the back of the chair mm -hmm. and we sit and do this? Or we're listening to music, we're not paying 100% yeah. attention. So the nice thing is you take your Neo, you attach it to your bag or put it inside your purse, in my case. Mm -hmm. I hang my purse on the back of the chair. I'm listening to music, I'm texting, I'm looking at Facebook, whatever mm -hmm. I'm doing. As soon as somebody picks up the device, so here I've turned on my emotion alert, this is running in the background, it immediately alarms. So oh, again, wow. getting my attention before it goes missing. So Neo is to prevent the loss or theft of your device. Mm -hmm. It's a friendly little reminder that says, hey, pay attention to me before you forget me, before somebody runs out with mm -hmm. your bag. 
on that. Another really great thing is airports. How many times you're sitting in an airport, especially with all the delays with this weather, Yes. you want to have a bit of a nap, but you're paranoid because if somebody takes your carry-on or does anything, mm -hmm. you want to keep a really tight leash on it. So what yeah. you can do is you can set the motion alert on this. Mm -hmm. You're listening to your music or doing whatever you're doing, mm -hmm. and immediately again, as soon as somebody picks it up, it's going to alarm. So we've created an entire launch pad of apps that gives you a whole bunch of oh, functionality great. for your NEO. So once you purchase your NEO, you have access to all these apps. So you have your NEO Locate. This is a great product for people who are forgetful. So uh -huh. let's say you're at home, this is attached to your keys, you know you're within the radius because your NEO is attached to your phone <laughs> or your iPad. I only laugh because I do this all the time. I know exactly where you're going. Yeah, so you can hit Locate, <laughs> and now it tells me I'm really close to my device. Oh, but yeah, as you're I fire. move away, you can getting see it's warmer, getting colder. Getting colder. Right, and as I come closer, Got it's it. getting colder. Okay. The other really nice thing is on your actual Neo, you have a button that you can hit that lets you find your device. Mm -hmm. The cool thing about this is we bypass the silent feature because I don't know about you, but I'm at home, I turn my phone on silent, it's in the couch, it's under newspapers, it's mm -hmm. somewhere, and I cannot find it, I can't call it because I can't locate it. Right, so because the, I put it on, you know, vi or silent, no vibrate, and good yeah. luck. <laughs> so the nice thing is you just press locate, and it automatically will have the device alarm for you. On oh, that. wow. So again, a little bit more functionality. So the, the neat thing about Neo is you're not just buying a device that does one thing. Mm -hmm. you're, devi you're buying a piece of hardware that gives you a Bluetooth chain to your device and it constantly evolves. So the nice thing is oh, cool. as new apps are being developed, you're constantly getting new applications on that. So another really cool function that we like is Neo tracking. What Neo tracking does is it gives you the last known GPS location where your alarm went off. Oh, wow. So, okay. for example, you can see we're at New Egg's head office. Mm -hmm. This is where my alarm was triggered. So mm -hmm. I can look and say, okay, if I had walked out without my iPad or my iPhone, I would know immediately where I lost it. So therefore, decreasing the amount of time it takes me to locate the device mm -hmm. on that. So this is another functionality. A lot of companies who give phones for business like this because you can set it up to automatically alert you mm -hmm. of where the person was where they lost the device. So IT can immediately be given a notification. Mm -hmm. They can say, okay, the person's in an area where we have a security breach. We don't want anyone to access it. Therefore, they can lock the phone, wipe it, do whatever they need to do to protect the data in it. Yeah, that's um, the really important thing. People think that the uh, expensive, valuable thing is the actual device. You don't realize that mm -hmm. what you could really lose is, you know, access to your bank accounts. And that is far more valuable, especially if you use banking apps and they can get in there and get that information. I mean, that's way more valuable to a, a potential thief than the actual device itself. Exactly. Um, and, and our whole lives are wrapped up in this. So. Yeah, yeah, we are definitely now completely tethered to our devices. Um, if you know, especially you know, working on the go as a professional, you're going. Mm -hmm. You need you need these things in order to function um, successfully in what you do day to day. So it's very important to have something that's you know just you need your own loss prevention. You can't trust that it's going to come from anywhere else. So it's a really good uh, proactive item towards protecting your investments and also your personal data. Yes. Uh, you showed me this one earlier. What is the Neo Guard? So the Neo Guard is, let's say you're at a coffee shop, mm -hmm. and a lot of people will sit their iPads down or their iPhones, and mm -hmm. they they are doing something else. They're talking, having a great conversation. They just want a little bit added protection. So you can turn your Neo Guard on, and what it does is it allows you to now have an alarm set on your device. So if anybody was to pick up your device, it immediately alarms, okay. telling you pay attention before it goes missing. On that, so that's how Neo. So Guard you're works. at the coffee shop. You've got your iPad on the table. You get up. You go to the bathroom. You leave mm -hmm. it there. Someone picks it up, and then everyone at the coffee shop is now looking at that person. So even if they make off with the device, then you have all those witnesses that can, you know, help you facilitate you finding know, it. Yeah, finding <laughs> it or reporting it on in, that at any rate. But. Um, Okay, very cool. I think one of the last questions I was kind of wondering about is, um, will the Neo be able to be used more widely with Android devices in the future? I know right now it's primarily an iOS device, mm -hmm. and you are um, able to use it on the Galaxy S3, S4, and the Note 3. Yes. Um, will it be more widely used on Android in the future? 
Right. The limiting factor for Android is the Bluetooth. So it's Bluetooth okay. 4.0. So it's a technology limitation. I see. So as more Android devices are using the newer technology, mm -hmm. it'll open up that marketplace. So that's the um, that's the Android 4.3. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So as more phones, more smartphones, more tablets are opening up using this technology, then mm -hmm. we'll be able to open it up. So we're already in Google Play, obviously, for these other devices. Right. So what we do, if anyone wants to check, they mm -hmm. can go download the app for free and mm -hmm. it will tell them based on their device if they're compatible or not. So they can always do that check before they purchase it just to make sure that it is compatible. Do you have any final thoughts or maybe uh, some unexpected uses for the Neo that people wouldn't you know, think of? Yeah, think of right off the top of their head. Yeah, one thing I do is when I'm at the dog park, I have a dog, a big giant schnauzer, and when I'm at the dog park and he's off leash, mm -hmm. I'm busy talking or doing something on my phone. Mm -hmm. So what I do is I attach this to his collar and I set the distance and then that way, if he goes out of range, immediately it alerts uh -huh. me and I grab him before he goes missing. So. Again. That's awesome. It's an alarm for your dog. And you know what? A lot of dogs do get kidnapped, especially like sought after breeds. Yes. So that is awesome. And um, what, uh, you told me about another one earlier. I think people using it to find their kids. <laughs> yeah, I, I would never suggest to depend on this for your children. But yeah, Obviously. if you're if you're at the mall or something and you just want to keep a nice leash on them, you can attach this to your child, and then that mm -hmm. way you know immediately if they happen to walk out of range, if they go hide under the clothes. I know my yeah. kids do that all the time. They're hiding in little nooks and crannies while you're trying to try <laughs> things on. So it gives you a little bit more security, so you always know they're staying right there. Um, That's it, great. Those are some great alternative uses and I imagine you could probably carry those uses over onto anything that y you might be concerned about walking off yeah, any, any <laughs> yeah. I mean, even instruments, musical instruments, some uh, yeah. people who play really expensive musical instruments, they put these inside their cases, that way they don't have to worry about forgetting them or losing right. them or them walking away. So That's cool. anything you want to protect, it, because it's a two-way alarm system, it gives you that added functionality. Great, that's awesome. This is Neo, and again, Excellent. it's just, let's try and prevent that stress. Everybody is so stressed because our lives are in these devices, all our information, and the last thing you want is pictures of your kids and uh, your life out mm -hmm. there on the internet. So let's, this device is just to give you that little friendly reminder. It creates a leash, so now you can keep a closer tab on your stuff. Exactly, very cool. Well, thank you, Trisha, really appreciate it. All right, so if you like this interview and want to know more about this product, please check it out on Newegg.com. Also, if you've liked this video and found it helpful, please subscribe to our various YouTube channels. Until next time, I'm Jennifer, and thank you for watching Newegg TV.